Hello guys, this is True Ray here with news from Apple's WWDC event. So first, they refreshed the MacBook Airs and MacBook Pros. The MacBook Airs will have up to 2 GHz Core i7 with Turbo Boost, making that up to 3.2 GHz. It'll have 720p HD FaceTime camera. On the 11 inch model, it'll have a screen resolution of 1366 by 768 with an Intel HD graphics 4000. The 13 inch will have a 1440 by 900 screen resolution and both will have 3.0 ports with a capacity of 8 gigabytes of RAM. You can have storage up to 512 gigabytes. The price will be $1,000 for the basic model, all the way up to $1,100 for the most advanced model. For the MacBook Pros, the 13 and 15 inch models will both be running 2.7 gigahertz quad core i7s with turbo boost up to 3.7 gigahertz. Both will have 8 gigs of RAM and both will have GeForce GT 650M graphics which promises up to 60% faster than previous models. Again they'll have 3.0 ports and the price will range for the 13 inch model $1100 and for the basic 15 inch model $1800. And Apple left a little surprise with the next generation MacBook Pros all new MacBook Pros which will have a retina display with a 2880 by 800 resolution 0.71 inch thin and weighs around 4.46 pounds it'll have higher contrast ratios better viewing angles and reduced glare it can have up to 16 gigs of RAM and it'll have a NVIDIA Kepler GT 650M graphics I have a quad core 2.7 gigahertz core i7 processor, a maximum of 768 gigabytes of solid state storage, and it promises around 7 hours of battery life and 30 days of standby. And the price for the basic model will be 2200 for a 2.3 gigahertz with 8 gigabytes of RAM and 256 gigabytes of solid state storage and this will be available today also with the other refreshed MacBook Airs and MacBook Pros so I hope you enjoyed this video there will be more information about these products down below so I'm out, be breezy